Got some top from this stripper bitch. What's going on, y'all, bro? We back at it. But this time, yo, we doing a podcast, bro. You see my nigga Brian we're over here, bro. We, he had an idea to do a podcast. I'm like, damn, we should do this because I, you know, I have the I have the facilities to to do it, the the equipment to do it. So we're gonna do a podcast, bro. You wanna say what's up, my guy? Hi. I was about to give you a microphone. Like you don't have your own mic. My dumbass. Anyways, yeah, you see me? I holding my microphone. This nigga got he got he got a little shirt shit because you know Can't see. I got the equipment. And we're gonna be talking about some random ass shit, bro. It's just a, we're just gonna be chilling, bro. Anyways, it's your mom's birthday today. It is my mom's birthday. Everybody today. go wish this man's uh, mama uh, happy birthday in the comments, bro. Yeah, we surprised. We surprised her. Yeah, bro. She, she almost teared up, but she's she's never teared up in her life. <laughs> really? Nah. Shit, bro. Yeah. Your mom's tough. Yeah. All right. Um, you heard about Curry dropping sixty two points crazy. last night, bro? That was crazy. That crazy. shit. That- so, that shit's impressive, nah. and niggas was slandering that nigga, bro. And yeah. he he came out and showed, bro. Niggas. Him and Draymond combined for sixty three. <laughs> that shit was crazy. That shit was crazy. <laughs> Everybody think of Draymond had one point. <laughs> that shit was crazy. Oh my god, that, that nigga nah. Wiseman's getting good though. Yeah, yeah way better. I like it. I thought I thought Anthony Edwards was gonna be a bust. I thought, but he, he, he he's started, not doing that bad. Yeah, he started going out. But I out. feel like he's like the top three right now. I mean, obviously Wiseman's a center. Yeah. So it's not like he's gonna get that many points in a game. Yeah. But let's say Lamelo, he's a point guard. Obviously, a point guard, you know, initiates fucking plays and shit like obviously, that. Obviously, obviously. But let's say like, I don't know if he's doing. Like, I want to say he's doing like good, but he's doing better since the, the the like the first two games. Yeah. But now he's like pulling up threes somewhat deep. Not With that much. jump shot, but what? Yeah, that, I don't know how he jumps like that, bro. That's a, like he gets an inch off the ground and still makes that shit. It makes like, no sense. Like to auto. Me. It makes no auto sense. Auto vertical. Um, like same thing. Yeah, bro. And uh, who fuck the fucking Wizards beat the Nets by one point. Now they both missed. And Kyrie, Kyrie and yeah, Kyrie and Katie missed game winning shots. Yeah. And then you know the niggas got the dub, the second win, two crazy. and five. Or there's still there's never been a team in NBA history. To ever um, make it to the playoffs, being 0 five. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Did y'all know that? I didn't know that. Uh, who who's the four? Who's know. the fourteenth team above the Wizards? I know it's, it's some trash ass team. I I knew some. I knew it was one team. I forgot. Like, like, but my conferences. Those team that team above them are losing like a lot. I think it's the Pistons. It might be the Pistons. So I feel like if the Pistons really sell. Who the fuck they did they, they play? A team yesterday. They played the Celtics. Yeah, that's who they played. And the uh, um Jason, Jason Tatum, Tatum had a he had a game winner. That's and true. they, Second of the and season. they had a he had a game winning block too. Oh he blocked yeah, for like the game tie. Yeah. And he blocked Ever it. Ever since out of bio did it to him in the playoffs, he's like He's like, fuck he's that nigga. Look for that nigga now. bam, that's bro. That's what he's doing. That's what he's doing. Fuck that nigga bam. bam. That Anyways. Bam. What else? What else? But yeah, no, nah, I'm just like I don't know. I feel like also like the heat. Y'all y'all can't see, but Danny has a Miami Heat poster here. Oh, I pretty sure they sell in the videos. Yeah, um the heat, I feel like they just gotta get like settled. Yeah, you know? yeah. Like, I feel like the heat they are they trying to settled. go too fast, bro. Yeah. Uh, who, who they go against the other day? The Mavericks. And Jimmy Butler only scored two points. Yeah. And it's just like they need Jimmy Butler to win. But yeah. they obviously like show they don't really need him because of the Milwaukee game. But at the same time, I feel like if Jimmy Butler's there, they're gonna win the game. Even if he no, sometimes he'll he'll sell. Even 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 it's like he, they don't need him on offense either because it's like obviously he's their best scorer but he's also like he's really gonna other than out of bio yeah. he's their best defender yeah like on the wing on the on the three like everywhere he's he's really good except for when out of bio got sauced up by Luca <laughs> oh my god I mean out of bio is like almost seven feet tall. yeah but I mean Luca did fucking like I mean yeah if you're a defender you're not gonna know what the fuck that nigga's doing so it's inevitable that you're gonna get fucking I don't wanna say like crossed up. But like you know, get faked. Like he, he thought I was gonna go yeah. for a fade away, and this nigga went under. Like yeah. I wouldn't guess that shit. Unless I'm a, you're Rudy Gobert in his two hundred million dollar contract, or you're fucking, uh, <laughs> you got a fucking eight three wingspan. Yeah, fucking block true. that shit from a mile away. My nigga Bobo, my nigga Bobo, fucking same height, same wingspan as your height. You know I'm related to Bobo. Yeah, me too. Fun fact. Yeah. You know I'm black. I'm related. I'm not, but I'm related to Bobo somehow. I'm related, I'm, I'm related to Manu Ball. I could you I see it. He was my he was my brother. I see it. The height and everything. Yeah, for sure, for <laughs> it, sure. Really, I would have been like seven feet tall, but you know, 
they had to like <laughs> they just stop, can't, they, they canceled the, canceled the subscription. Yeah, they, they canceled yeah, the other mid, foot. Yeah, so they had to leave me at six foot four. That's crazy. Yes, yeah, that's, that's it's, crazy. It's weird. But now I thought Edwards is gonna be a bust. Like I, I, I remember Kong. I was telling Kong about this. Kong subscribe to Kongzilla. Um, I was telling Kong about it. I was like, I don't think Edwards is gonna be good because I feel like he's gonna let the hype yeah, get to he, him. You told me the same thing. Yeah, that he's. He he doesn't put enough effort in basketball, but clearly yeah, he doesn't need to. But no, he's he's, he's good. He's good. He's, he's not. Good. I want to say he's raw because most most NBA players are raw. But yeah, like, no. I course. wouldn't. But like he's not really like you know like that top tier number one pick. No, nah, for sure. Because sure. who was the number one pick that did really obviously LeBron, but that's besides yeah. the point. From like a Lonzo, uh, Lonzo's doing pretty good. He's not. He's Lonzo wasn't number one though. He was number two. Yeah, my fault. My fault. No, Marco Fultz. Marco yeah. Fultz is doing good now. He is doing pretty good. The magic, the magic have been going crazy. Yeah, they got Cole. They uh, they got Cole Anthony. That shit was, that was oh, a no, steal. The Cole Anthony. Steal. Oh my god, he's huge really good. Steal. Huge. There was a, what? There was a no. That's four and one, four and two, whatever. I forgot the. Yeah. Sp- just four and zero, oh. and then they. I think they. I forgot what team they lost to, but they was doing pretty good until like most teams who were undefeated, they just sell for like the next game and they, nah, they can't yeah. hit shots. So I'm saying like, if it's football. If I like in football, you could stay undefeated, un- undefeated, and still longer easy, than easy. oh no, yeah, NBA. yeah, because that shit changes all the time. You could like your coach, you just get out coached like that. It's crazy. Yeah, I mean, same thing happens in football. Football is just longer periods of time. Yeah, but you have I a feel whole like, week. Let's say the next game. let's say the um the Chiefs, right? They lost one game and they haven't lost a game since. So I feel like they they stayed good. And, you know, I mean, they always had like one point games or something like that for a win. Yeah, but like you know, their defense actually you know stepped no, up. No, their defense, yeah. Ever since they got uh, Tyron Matthew from yeah, Houston, their defense, their defense is scary. A couple years ago, yeah, scary, been, they've bro. been going crazy. They've been going crazy. And Kelsey, don't even get me started on Kelsey. Oh no, Travis Kelsey, he's a different breed. That nigga's like, a good ass receiver, bro. By the end of his career, he's gonna be the greatest tight end of all time. Oh yeah, better he's than a receiver, Gronk, better like, than Gronk, better than than fucking. What's that name? Tony Gonzalez. I don't know. I couldn't think of it. He, he's a tight end. I said receiver because he receives the ball. That's, that's true, I'm not that's saying true, like he's, he's a wide end, receiver. He's a tight end, he's but tight end. I'm saying like um, like when LeBron would play, yeah. tight end, not wide receiver. Um, but like let's say Tyreek Hill, he's pretty good. Uh, you know, sometimes you know a couple drops, couple no catches, <laughs> couple of shit. I don't know. I still don't understand how that touchdown didn't count because nobody even knew that he fucking recaught the ball at the fucking yeah, end zone. Yeah, they wasn't paying. He didn't even know. Either. He didn't even know. <laughs> and they didn't even know either, so it didn't count. But they still won the game anyways. It didn't even matter. Yeah. Anyways, the other thing I want to talk about, speaking of Kong, bro, this nigga did the gayest shit last he night, did. bro. He oh, did, bro. my You want me to get God. the picture? I'll get yes, the picture. Please. I'll get the picture. Bro, this nigga is next level. I'm going to call him out on, there, on here too, bro. Mm, nigga yeah. is next level sus, buddy. He did some really out of pocket. So, so I, we was chilling, and then I come home. Nigga, I look at the group chat, and this nigga's talking about this nigga's eating... Oh, I don't know if you can see it. The fucking oh, the ring light, light is light, is yeah. fucking it up. Anyways, it's, it's a waffle. It's, it's, shaped yeah, like you a can penis. see it. It's a fucking dick waffle. <laughs> so so look, this so what, our female friend she works at this waffle place, right? They don't even make normal waffles. I don't even know how the fuck you don't make normal waffles at a waffle place. Anyways, she goes to the nigga's house, gives him a dick waffle, and this nigga just chilling in the Xbox party, enjoying the dick waffle. Yeah. It was half of it was gone in one bite. Bro, I, I don't know how this nigga was deep throating that shit, bro. Yeah, that was, he was sus. Going crazy. He was going crazy. I wonder who made the mold for the dick waffle, bro. That nigga's gay. That nigga's gay. Nigga sus. That was sus. Next level, bro. But like, nah. Oh um, my god, that nigga's gay. Fucking bro. somebody that was dropping a lot of passes that's actually catching anything now is Deontay Johnson on the Steelers. Oh yeah. He started catching all the balls and I'm all the balls. And I'm really I'm really proud of him because it's like obviously he's, this is his second year. He's not like Tyree Kill level, but yeah, you know he can hold his own. Claypool's in his first year. Obviously, Steelers fan. No. Was Claypool's first year? Yeah. He was oh, did I know that? Drafted. Claypool's first year. Juju's like fourth. Yeah, Juju's been playing for a little bit. Uh, you know, I don't... Still young. Still learning, honestly. Yeah. Well, I, see, I feel like when you pass 30, that's when you like really That's good. when you're like a veteran. Yeah, yeah that's, that's when you... Like Antonio Brown. Yeah, that's when you get like pretty good at the game and you know the knowledge and shit like that. Yeah. I feel like every player is good by like 26 and up. In like, any in any sport, yeah, for like especially for the NBA, as soon as you're like 26, that's when you start getting good. Except for like niggas like Jason Tatum, that like, niggas yeah. been good since he got to the league. Niggas are raw. I mean that draft class was insane. The fucking was it 2017? Yeah, that entire nah, that, that, that draft, draft class, class is class fucking crazy. crazy. Except for crazy. um, except for uh, who's a sell? Who's a sell, bro? You could say Mark Del Folds, but yeah. no, but he's doing good now. He's doing good now. Yeah, he just started getting good. Cause who was it? It was it was it was Markel Lonzo, yeah. JT. Uh huh. Who was fourth? I, I have no clue who was fourth. Fuck was fourth. I have no clue. 
Um, I feel like De'Aaron was fifth. I think we got De'Aaron fifth. Oh, yeah, he was in 2017. Yeah, I don't know. I know Bam was, Bam was uh, 14. He yeah, was the last Bam, lottery yeah. pick. Yeah. That's crazy. They keep changing the lottery. Now it's like top like 12 picks, 13 picks, is it? No, it's top 14. It's still 14? Yeah. Oh. So it's... I'm just saying, because NBA's been changing their draft the past... I think it's like the past six years they've changed their draft. Really? Yeah, like they've know. changed I mean, like little shit on it. I just got into like the NBA last year. That's true. That's true. So I, I mean, really I got into it to. freshman year and I'm a senior now, so... And I just got into the NFL like two months ago, three months ago. <laughs> I'm not real. I wasn't a sports nigga, but now I'm watching that. I start watching that shit. I'm like, damn, shit's, sports is fucking fire. It's fun, bro. Now it's you think fun. you're a nerd and you don't watch sports, bro? Sports is fuck. I mean, honestly, if you understand it, it's it's, it's enjoyable. If you don't yeah. understand it, like when I was watching, I'm like, what the fuck are these niggas hitting each other for? Same shit with video games. Yeah, like if you don't know how to play, you're not gonna understand. You're not gonna exactly. Understand you're it. not gonna enjoy it if you yeah, don't know how just... to play. Like my game that I play all the time. You know. Like <laughs> uh, okay for Smite, bro. <laughs> Like, I understand how the game works, but I just don't understand how to, like, go through a match. Like, right, you go around, kill people, you know, you use your, your, your different attacks and shit like that. <laughs> These are the shit like it's Pokemon. I mean, it's, ba- it's basically like League of Legends, but yeah, instead I, of from a ceiling, like, from, like, a sky point of view, it's yeah, third it's, person. It's like, it's a, yeah, it's third person instead of that fucking GTA yeah. fucking one looking at shit. Yeah. Anyways, but League, I played League, uh, like, for, like, two days in a row one time, like, two years ago, three years ago. And, bro, I fucking straight up, boom, my monitor, bro, it's gone. I even have a fucking clip. I think there's a clip on Twitch of me punching my monitor from League, bro. You have the clip? You can import it? Honestly, I probably could. But uh, what else? (laughs) Uh, For Smite, I could understand the game. If I actually played it, I would, you know, understand everything. It's kind of obvious. I mean, it's it's easy. Well, it's easy to understand the game and to start playing it. But once you get into, like, the competitive level, it gets really hard because... There's people that have been playing that game for all seven years. Exactly. It's been out. Yeah, exactly. So yeah. it's Same just like you're just, you're just gonna get smacked. Nick, or for let's say uh, World of Warcraft, like niggas yeah. played. Oh, no, actually, what's another game? I think RuneScape. Some yeah. other shit. But niggas be playing that game since day one when it came out, and then niggas are raw as fucking the game. And they always play the game. They're sweats, bro. So you're just sweats. like, I'm just like, mm, I don't, I don't really know. But so I'm just like, I don't want to get into that shit because niggas already sweats on that shit. They're sweats at it, bro. Uh, let's say like, uh, like Cold War. Cold War, um, it's, it's pretty easy to play the game, honestly. You could get man, good in, Call like, it's Call a Duty, week. Yeah. Just play the game. Um, Call of Duty's easy. Same thing. Honestly, Fortnite was... I would say Fortnite's <laughs> not... Honestly, Fortnite. But, I played uh, Fortnite for two seasons and I stopped playing. <laughs> uh, Fortnite, I want to say is... You just got to have, like, good uh, hand-eye coordination. Yeah. I mean, it's for every game, though. Yeah. But, like, for Fortnite, you got to know, like, fucking pull out your builds and shit and build... The yeah. game. That's another fucking thing that add into a game for you. you gotta that you gotta worry yeah, about. Yeah, that's the thing that's like that I that I like I see different from like Smite, which is like obviously like those skill based you know objective game based games. Other than Fortnite and COD, yeah, I feel like Fortnite and COD you think at the moment, and for like Smite or like League of Legends you think ahead. You have to think. Yeah, like you have next. to think. You have to think five minutes ahead. Yeah, ten minutes ahead. Like what? what Wait, I mean, see, I see people do the same thing on COD. Like you know when they like pre fire something like that. Oh yeah, know some yeah. players gonna go into yeah. that corner. Of course. But like, I feel like for like obviously Chris Mike, you gotta think like, like way more. Yeah, like a lot of minutes ahead. Like, you gotta like, think. Like you gotta like think. Oh, this guy's going right here. Oh, if I do this, this guy's gonna come right here. Oh, I know. Like yeah. you know where your teammates are, where the niggas are coming from, or how much, like what time your fucking yeah. ultimate <laughs> like coming your back ability, and shit. Yeah. You have to time everything. Yeah. Before so you, you gotta get into know a fight. everything. No, it's it's it's, it's really hectic. Up. It's really hectic. You know. Then as soon as you use your ult. And you don't have it anymore, bro. You're fucked. I mean, the person who knows all about that is Kong. Kong's the greatest Smite player I know. Yeah, bro. Way better sure. than me. Way better than all my friends. You Kong's say, been you in the team. You say Kong is better than Dini? <laughs> I'm like... <laughs> way better than me. Oh, I thought you said <laughs> Dini. I'm like, bro, they're literally the same person, bro. <laughs> no, Kong's been in the Smite scene for six years. Six years, yeah, all right. Yeah, he's been yeah, going ham. Right. He's been going ham. Been but, going ham. uh, what is it? Nah, the game's really, like, it's really strategic. And it's like, I'm not going to sit here and be like, oh, you know, it's hard as fuck. Like, only only specific people can play it because obviously that's not I don't true. think it's hard. I just I just got to get into it yeah, for me to actually play the game. Because I remember have experience. when we first played that one time a while ago, uh, I didn't do that bad. I, was, I remember there was a point where I had no kills and I had like four deaths or something like that. And I was getting pissed. But then I think like, it's just like when I'm running away from someone... They just <laughs> full speed bum rush me and fuck me up. So I'm just like, what the fuck is that? Same thing in League of Legends. That's why I stopped playing the game. Yeah. So I got mad at that shit. So with Smite, I was just like, let me slow down or something like that. 
and um, you know, fucking coordinate shit. So I would yeah. like hit 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 someone a couple times and then run away for a little bit. Come back, hit him a couple times, run away, and just you know get assists. Yeah. But for uh, like I don't know, like obviously in Smite you gotta if y'all don't know Smite you gotta buy you gotta auto buy what is it? buy items yeah you to make buy your, items your thing stronger yeah to make your attack your stronger to have more health to have all that shit so that's another thing you gotta keep on top of everything else in the game so it's like there's so much multitasking in the game that you gotta keep uh keep what is it you gotta keep Stay on your, top you gotta, of yeah you gotta keep your head on yeah that's yeah, why yeah. kong is so good at it because he's amazing at multitasking <laughs> man's the greatest player i've ever seen i keep my shit on auto i just every, everything just auto <laughs> level up and shit like that because i don't care about it I don't want to worry about it yeah, either. Nah, I mean, I've been I've been playing obviously ranked the competitive part of it, but I've been like watching like the actual like league and shit because they have a league for that shit. But it's like I don't know. I just want to like. Uh, I haven't watched competitive shit, shit in a while. Hard. I used to watch competitive Fortnite. I used to watch that so hard. Yeah, competitive Cod was Cod, insane. I didn't watch that shit. I used to you know T Martin. Yeah. He used to have game battles and shit. I would watch that. But I never watched like no, the I pro used, league and I like did. arenas and shit like that. Yeah, the MLG league. I used yeah. to watch. I watched the 2012, which was the BO2 one. It was the 2013. The last one I watched was BO3. BO3. What? Nah, I, I never saw the main BO3. game. I only and saw AW. a couple. I saw. I saw BO2. I saw Ghost. Yeah, Ghost I saw Ghost. Ghost. I saw Ghost too. Ghost was. They had a pretty. I feel like Ghost was a pretty good game for like. I think it was a good game. For S and D, it was pretty good. Or for like that competitive shit. Yeah. In fact, they have a really good competitive like. Like, a lot of people um, shit talk the game, all this and that. You can talk shit, all your shit. You, like, obviously. Honestly, I love Ghost. When I played but, that shit, it was the first card I got on Next Gen. Or when I got my PS4. First card I got, and it was the first card I was grinding until I got AW later on, and then BO3, and then, um... Then last... The, the last card... I, no, it was NW. I played NW on my, my PS4. Yeah. Because I don't have it on my computer. I don't think Ghost was that bad. No. I think I, people are I, talking really down on it for no reason. Yeah, I honestly... Honestly, I was a sniper. So yeah. I, I was just fucking snipe yeah. niggas. And, you know, I thought the sniping was pretty good in the game, too. It had its ups and downs. But uh, I, I was never, like, a person who used, like, a SMG, yeah. AR, and shit like that. But when I did, I don't really think I fucked anybody up like that. But uh, I think when I really started, like, fucking people up with a red gun, or if you don't, red gun, regular gun. Anyways, um, BO3. BO3 and the AW. I used to use the fucking, the ASM1, the speakeasy, bro. Yeah. Shit was fucking disgusting, my nigga. Uh, the CUDA and BO3, disgusting. VMP, Vesper, all that shit. KM44, disgusting, bro. You use that shit, niggas thought you was a sweat. Anyways, and the fucking M8. The M8 was fucking crazy. And BO2 and BO3. Yeah, the M8 one. All right, right now, right now. From starting at Modern Warfare 2, rank the cuts. Modern Warfare From 2. Modern Warfare 2 and where we are okay, now. Okay, so I'm not going to lie, right? So I didn't really have a... A last gen console, 360 and shit like that. So I think I didn't really play online for MW2, but I played the the multi, uh, I played the not multiplayer, the local shit, the, the campaign. That yeah, shit. yeah, that shit. And I played um my Warfare 2 on my computer before, like you know, mad, mad hackers. I found MW2. <laughs> it was a pretty good game. I had to rank it. Wait, so MW? There's MW2. What came out there? Was it three or BO1? It was three, wasn't it? And that was BO1. After MW2. Was it three? I'm pretty sure it was. Or was it? COD 4. No, I'm pretty sure. No. Um, no, COD 4 was... No, MW2, BO1, MW3, BO2, then Ghost. That's how it worked. Yeah. Um, I'm going to say for number one, yeah, my top game, I know people are going to get mad at this, is going to have to be BO3. Because I didn't play BO2 that much. <laughs> then after that, will probably be BO2. <laughs> well, I'll fucking BO3. I know, I know. Okay, look. I know niggas going to get mad at my opinion, bro. <laughs> I, no, it's, it's your opinion. It's your opinion, look, obviously. Look, I played... The, when I started playing BO2, like, a decent amount was on when I got on my computer a couple years ago. I think in like, 2016, I got on my computer. And I, I was like, oh, yeah, this shit's good. Honestly, you can't play it now on computer because it's fucking riddled with hackers. Yeah. Same thing with Xbox. No, for sure. But if I played it, honestly, I had a good time with it. But I didn't have, like, studio and all the DLC maps because I didn't want to play more for old ass game. Yeah. But BO3, I had, like... I think I had the most hours on Call of Duty on BO3. And then I think after that is... Uh, Maybe Advanced Warfare. How much time do you have on BO3? Honestly, I don't know. If, if I did have to calculate, it's probably like 300, 400 hours. I don't think it's that much. It's not but that much. I was about to say, I have more time on Smite, man. <laughs> yeah, but I, like it would be like, I'll play it for like five hours and get off. And then after yeah, one yeah, time, yeah. I'll just have it. I won't play it for like a couple, no, yeah. couple of days or I a couple mean, weeks. Okay. But I was pretty raw at the game. Warfare? No, I, no, BO3, BO2. Uh -huh. Then... um. I say MW2, MW3, 
Uh, what else? Let's just go. Okay, then AEW. Then Ghost. That's all. The no, I have to say fucking Cold War and all that shit too, right? Yeah. Oh, shit. And BO4, you gotta say all okay, them bitches. I'm gonna say. World War Two, all them bitches. Oh, damn, I didn't even World War Two, I was loaded. I didn't even play. I played World War Two for like two days. <laughs> two minutes? I don't even have two days on the game. <laughs> it was just like one hour each day. On, But BO4, I did play BO4 for a, a, a little bit. I got Diamond Snipers. No, I didn't get Diamond Snipers. I, got, I only got gold on two snipers. But I didn't want to do the last one because it was fucking trash. Anyways, I got Golden Sniper. And I enjoyed BO4, but I would I have do. to say, I, I think Cold War is better than um, BO4, though. Cold War is definitely better than World War II, in my opinion. I like oh, um, Cold a, War better. I really like World War II. I mean, you but played it a lot. That's that's the thing. I played it on a competitive level. I played yeah. game battles yeah. in that game. So, like, I played, like I had my team. We did a, all that league shit. I mean, that's why I, obviously, for me, it's a little bit higher because I spent a lot of yeah. time on the game. Okay, so, okay, so, so BO2, but, I mean, BO3, BO2, MW2, MW3. Um, then I'm gonna say a Cold War. Uh, what else? AW. Ghost. Then fucking. <laughs> with Bo Four, <laughs> World War Two, and what else? Infinite Warfare is all the way in the bottom. Infinite Warfare is fucking garbage. <laughs> yeah, Terrible remaster, game. Remaster, remaster it's so garbage. Oh yeah, I forgot. Remaster Remaster, too. Was remaster has to be probably above um. Bo Four. Damn, you, you I, I I liked the remaster. You gonna disrespect my BO4 like that? That's crazy. <laughs> no, That's but it's just crazy. like I feel like Infinite Warfare was fucking garbage though. We can all agree on that, right? Yeah. Right. I mean, in it my in bad. my opinion, I put Infinite Warfare over remastered. Really? Okay, yeah. that, I could I could I could agree with that honestly. Cause remastered but, was just N16. All okay, was. yeah, I feel that. But like, I played the. I don't think I played. No, I didn't really play the game series like that. Like I'll fuck niggas up with the the sniper. <laughs> I fuck niggas. Do that niggas get card. mad. You do that in every niggas card. get so mad from that shit. But uh, yeah. But Infinite Warfare is just like you be shooting somebody. No, you be going through a corner. You don't see someone, and you're instantly dead. Um, I like mean, when there was a tryhard or a sweat in the game, like you get yeah. fucking dominated. Oh yeah, I forgot NW. Modern Warfare. Yeah. I'd say Modern Warfare had to be um, maybe Modern Warfare is higher than uh, Cold War. You think so? I really, I never really played Modern uh, Warfare like that. I yeah, me neither. But fucking so. Modern Warfare, I feel like it, it. The game makes no sense. Like Dead Silence, you have to wait for your shit to charge up to use Dead Silence instead of it being a perk, right? Yeah. But I feel like MW is better than Cold War because it's it's more fast paced. Yeah. Like you see, nigga, you know the tactical sprint and shit like that. You you run so fast in the game, you could you maneuver through shit yeah. way faster than Cold War. And Cold War, it takes like so long. It I mean, some like shit game. you notice it's like, and like from my, you know, like yeah, point, you yeah. know, like from yeah, what I'm right looking, now. from what yeah. I'm looking, like I don't think Cold War has a single good map. Like compared to every other COD on release. I don't oh, think, on release, I don't think okay, yeah. Cold War is I, like anywhere I know, near. I know that Cold but, War's maps suck. On, obviously, Nuketown. I play Nuketown. Well, yeah. Nuketown is like that, the best yeah. map in the game, in my yeah, opinion. Yeah. And then, probably after that is Raid. Because, you know, Raid. <laughs> and Raid came from a different car. Yeah. So. But I'm saying, Nuketown's inevitable. It's going to come out. Like yeah, Black Nuketown's Ops. Gonna Every time you have Black Ops, it's going to be Nuketown. But Nuketown is like the one map you can play. And I want to say you probably get bored of. You could probably have like a really good game. And then after that, you probably get fucked up. I mean, that's the way Cold War fucking works. The way Cod works. It, but it's just like. Cold War is a. For Newtown, it's just so easy to get to. Like, it's so easy to run through a game because yeah. so, it, it's so fast-paced exactly. that you don't have to worry about anything. But let's say, like, fucking um, Miami, right? You're playing 6, no, 6v6 that's... Miami, right? That shit ain't going to work because that shit going to take too the long. The time limit goes down all the time. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. But 12v12 Miami? Let me find out. Let me find out. Let me find uh, out. But yeah, fucking my twelve v twelve Miami is just way better. It's way more fast paced. No, and yeah, if you play the fucking sure. domination, it's five fucking flags you gotta cap, and you know it's a decent. Like I say, the game's like fifteen minutes, twenty minutes long, but it's worth it though because you get a lot of score from that shit. That's why I leveled up That's a like lot. Half the time of a normal smite game. Yeah. Actually, yeah, fucking smite <laughs> games take fucking 30, 40 minutes, bro. I'm I mean, me and that, me bro. and Kong Kong Zilly, we played a sixty something minute game. But that wasn't even my highest. I played like a 70, 
eight minute game. Seventy one time. Holy yeah. shit. I think the longest game I ever been in the, any video game was probably um in Fortnite. So I like twenty six, twenty seven minutes. <laughs> Imagine, imagine being seventy-eight minutes just constantly doing something. Yeah, you're just doing the same thing over and like, over again for like can't piss, over can't an hour. <laughs> oh my god, I would never imagine. But that's the thing. That's why I like that game because it's like you're really not doing the same thing over and over. Can you get kicked for inactivity? Yeah, you can get kicked. Oh, for okay, makes sense. So because it's, it's like you fight, but obviously every fight's gonna be different. Yeah. You know, one one guy can pop his ability on this side, and then another guy on that side, and then you do the fight, and it'll flip. Like yeah. this guy's on this side, just like all positioning. It's really hard. Yeah. It's really hard. Especially playing with Kong. He sucks. <laughs> he sucks. And you just say he was good. <laughs> nigga, nigga sucks at every game he touches, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> if you're watching this, bro, I'm sorry, bro. But it's just like Cold War, I hate fucking. You know why? It's because of the dick wall. Niggas. <laughs> Because the dick wall. Nigga is always bottom fragger. Bottom of the leaderboard every single time we play Cold War or any call or any Call of Duty, bro. It's just like it's just I don't know. It's just like he just doesn't have the ability to be good at a video game. Yeah. I'm I always sorry, shit, I always shit talk him because he tells me to tell him when he does when he does good. Yeah, I remember I remember one time I, you know he's doing good if he if he's above you on the leaderboard. When we were playing Cold War, I'm like, there's no way I'm doing slow trash. This thing like, Kong is above me right now. And yeah. this thing is he's still going negative and he's above me. So I'm just like, what the fuck? Yeah, I and remember. And the next thing I know I'm He fucked. does good in Smite and then he tells me he's like, "Yo, you don't tell me good job. You don't tell me nice job all this and that." And I'm just like, "Shut up. I do, right?" And then when he does really good, I don't tell him anything. I was <laughs> like, <right>, fuck you. <laughs> you're, you're asking me to tell you a good job, and now I don't feel like doing it. Fucking sell your <laughs> Xbox, bitch. Now I don't feel like doing it. I mean, Kong, he, he's all right, I guess. It's fun to he's play with right. him. It's fun to play with him. It's fun. I don't play with him for I don't play with him for skill. I don't play with it's him fun to see him rage, because <laughs> we went to his house for what, New Year's Eve, right? Yeah. Went to his house, bro, and we was chilling. He was playing Smite, and I'm just like, bro. Let me find out you're going to throw your Xbox controller at the wall. And he just points at his wall as a nice fucking, like, dent. what is it, like, hole, I say, like, man. this, this big, and just a fucking dent in the wall from him throwing his controller and shit. Nigga throws his controller, nigga throws his headset. I was like, bro, I, I, I don't know. I stopped, I stopped doing, like, breaking shit. All I do is probably just smash my desk a little bit. And that's, that's <laughs> just a little much. bit, just a little bit. Just a little. So, so nice Damn, I feel a little crack right there. That's crazy. Honestly, it's <laughs> not even, my shit's not even cracked. You can see it's bent. I mean, like, not bent, but it's like it dips in the middle, but yeah. that's pretty much it. I wonder why, I wonder why. how dirty my fucking mouth is. Bro, I probably bro. sat on that bitch. Um, I don't even know, that shit been <laughs> bent. <laughs> Every time I built this desk, it should been bent. Oh my god. Nah, but, I don't know, I feel like, I, I definitely don't play with Kong for skill. No. Nah, no, I, I definitely don't. Hell no. If I play with Kong for skill, we lose all the time. <laughs> I play with Kong because he's my friend and I love him. And he's funny. He's a funny guy. He's a funny guy. Yeah. He's a funny but guy. A funny guy eating dick waffles, bro. <laughs> what a sus ass nigga. Let me find out he's eating dick waffles out here. What else what else what else can we talk about, bro? What to me, know? anything, bro. Anything. Bro, fucking uh you know it's one thing we every single time we're together, bro, just our whole group, right? So there's seven of us in a group. Not even okay, I wanna say that I wanna call Marcus, because he's not with us all the time. But let's say there's six of us in the group, right? We get around every time we get around each other, we always talk about jerking off for some odd reason. Yeah. It's always or jerking off sex, all that shit. I don't know Seen how no attention, all everything, all that Every shit. single time we be talking about that shit. I don't even know why. It, it just, just clicks it, in our head. Yeah, or like one person will be talking about some random ass thing and be like, bro, I just I hella beat my meat yesterday, bro. And I'm like, nigga, what? What are you on about? <laughs> Did you beat your meat yesterday? No. Yesterday? You didn't do it? You didn't do it? No. Oh, you don't do it at all? No, I don't do that shit, bro. Uh, me neither. I mean, I have a cross on yeah, my Yeah, exactly. Arm, so I got, I got, I don't, I'm a child of God, bro. I ain't do that shit. That shit weird, do, bro. I don't do any of that. But I heard, like, these... Uh, I, want, I want to disclose your name, bro, but I heard these females be talking to, bro. They be hoes. That's true. Yeah, I had, to, I had to think. I had to think, cause I was like, "We yeah, talk females? That's crazy." Yeah, I, I'm, no. I mean, honestly, I don't. They don't watch my damn all YouTube channel, so they're not gonna know. Anyways, but yeah, they be hoes out here, bro. They be they be snaking us, bro. My man, my they man, do, no, right? my, my man Brian been there way too many times, bro. He's been uh, uh, what is it? He's been rejected. You've been uh. <laughs> So I didn't mean to throw you under the bus. Yo, yo, what's up, man? I mean, bro. I've never talked to a female in my life. Me so, neither. I only uh, talk to dudes. I only talk to my mother. And my sister, and my mom, and my aunt, and my grandma, and yeah. I only talk to my mother. Oh, hey, yeah. Introvert that's, that's ass it. nigga, bro. I only talk, I only talk to so my mother. So you his mother, his mother, his mom's birthday, bro. It is my yeah, mom's birthday, yeah, bro. bro. Yeah, we already talked about time, that. Second time we said it. Yeah, yeah, yeah yes, sir, yes, that. sir. January 4th, you know? Fuck it, now. Who else's birthday? She, work, she works at a... She works at a daycare, right? Yeah. Kids. Like, really small kids. Mm -hmm. All of a sudden, she opens a present. It's a fucking wine bottle. And she almost popped that bitch in there. What the hell? All them kids near and everything. 
It's public drinking with kids in there. Ask the kids if they want some. You want some? <laughs> and, uh, it's some juice, some grape juice. And they go, oh what? Oh, my God. <laughs> that grape juice. But I was about to say, uh, do we know? I don't think we know anyone with their birthday during January, right? Except for your mom, but that's obvious. But like, I do, regardless. but I don't feel like saying. Uh, I have no, I have, I don't know anybody with their birthday on January. I know Marcus' birthday on uh, February. Yes, sir. And my nigga Rob, my nigga Rob birthday on Fe- February. Oh, too. shout out my dog Rob. My dog Rob with a Mustang. Them, yeah, playing them strings. Uh, who else? Yes, sir. March, y'all niggas March. You me and, and Otto. Me and Toto. Uh, April. Double me, me and Stefano in April. May, my little brother's birthday's in May. June, Dini's birthday's in June. I thought his. I never get it right. I'm the June or July. It's the like, ending of June. I know it's one of those. And Janie's birthday is June also. My mom's birthday is June. July, I, have, I don't know anybody's birthday is July. Isn't like, isn't Alyssa's birthday is July? No. No? Oh, I don't really give a fuck. Anyways. August. August. Damn, niggas really be born August, bro. Like, your birthday's so late. You gotta wait so long. Like, your birthday's after <laughs> hey, the school year's September. Finished. Uh, but his 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 birthday is like when school year starts. Yeah, I mean, but, if, even if it's in August, year is year that's when it starts. Like late August. Yeah, but I mean that's your like. So imagine your birthday being on the starting. Day like as soon as as soon as school starts, bro, you're already eighteen. And niggas like, how the fuck are you eighteen already? I mean, that's if you I mean, Otto's gonna graduate like twenty seven. Yeah, so. that niggas fuck. If you gonna graduate? He's he, well, he's gonna turn nineteen and, be, and graduate. The niggas, <laughs> you weird. I'll, I'm so I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be eighteen when I graduate though. Same. That's uh, if I graduate. Who's gonna be? Who's gonna? No, none of us is gonna be. Uh, 17 when we graduate we're, no, gonna... we're not that fucking smart <laughs> that's funny you know what's the funniest thing you know what's the funniest thing bro fucking uh tell me how i'm the tallest slash biggest nigga in the group and i'm the youngest he is let that sink in he is the youngest tallest by inches many inches yeah I'm biggest by many inches too anyways but yeah like fucking auto auto's birthday is march but he's born like a whole year before us and then after that, is, uh, no, D- okay, I won't count Dini because he's not in our school year. He's not yeah. in our, our, our class. Yeah, Dini's two years ahead yeah, of Yeah, he's fucking old. What an old bitch ass nigga, bro. That boy Kong. We didn't get Kong here. We talked about him so much. Yeah, I talked to him. Bro, this nigga <laughs> FaceTimed me last night. And we was on that bitch for like an hour or two hours, maybe. Jesus Christ. And this nigga just sends me TikToks and we be talking about some shit. We, he told me about this show called Most Expensive um, Shit. And or most expensive restaurant, something like that, with two chains and some shit. Oh, niggas, I know what you're about. niggas yeah, was eating like that. weed hot wings, mm-hmm. weed asparagus, weed all this shit. And I remember we was talking. It was fifteen hundred dollars for seventy weed um, wings. And I was like, That's "What awesome. the fuck?" There That's was a, a lot. There of, was an episode. It's twenty dollars each wing. Damn. Like. That's a lot of money. That's like, I remember because I follow him on Instagram. There's a, an episode where it was like a little piece of steak. I say about like this big, yeah. maybe like a Kit Kat size. And it had gold on top, like dead yeah. ass gold. That shit was like twenty k. Yeah, that shit. That shit. So <laughs> like, like, why would you pay that much just to eat that? That's just a flex. That's like, just a flex. That was crazy. And tell me earlier, this nigga called me. He he calls me just so he can see my reaction to TikToks that he sent me. <laughs> so I'm just like, what the fuck? So then he, I'm just chilling there. I'm like, oh, this nigga dinner plate. This nigga dinner plate's calling me. Hey, and, uh, keep this out the video. I think he's uh, kind of slow. Just a little, just a little bit. Yeah, <laughs> nigga calls me, bro, and it just be dead. We just dead ass be laughing and just talking about some <laughs> some random ass shit. I think I was laughing at uh, <laughs> we were laughing at this video because we was watching. I was watching all this TikTok where Flight was uh, he was making a video, he was reacting, and I know nigga just got high as fuck out of nowhere. And I started dying laughing. I sent it to him, bro. I'm like, and he even he wasn't even laughing that hard. I, I thought it was Flight. fucking hilarious. Shout out Flight. Shout out Curry. Well, fuck First that nigga 62, Flight, bro. 62, I fuck that nigga 62, up, bro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> fucking hell. Anyways, do you, have any, do you have any more to talk about? We ended right here, bro. It's 33 minutes. Could we? Could we end it? You think so? You want to? You want to? We got to think of a name, bro. Leave names down in the yeah, comments. Yeah, actually, really, for real, we need leave names. names down in the comments, bro. We're going to do more podcasts and shit like that. I was like thinking that. of a name while I was taking a shower because that's all I do in the shower, I think. I don't even wash myself. I just think. Brandables. <laughs> actually, no. So I mix your name with my 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 persona name. So it got to be like yeah. MVP... Marshall Moose. There you go. <laughs> yes, sir. I was thinking or like Dana Mello. I was Dana like, Mello. <laughs> I was thinking it's like we do a thing where it's like we go on uh Twitter's trending and then call it like Twitter like uh Twitter trending Tuesdays or Twitter trending Thursdays, whatever. Think so? Actually that's a really good idea to look on Twitter, see yeah. what's going on and then talk about some shit. That's what I was that'll be a good a good ass thing. Anyways, y'all could talk y'all could tell us what to talk about next podcast. It's gonna be weekly, bro. I say every Wednesday. Every Wednesday. Every Wednesday? So what the fuck's the point of calling it Tuesday or Thursday if it's going to be Wednesday? 
Okay, it could be Wacky Wednesday. <laughs> the fuck? Wa- wacky Slush Wednesday, nigga. <laughs> but the S don't... <laughs> like, <laughs> Wednesday. <laughs> Miami Monday. Oh, yeah, it is Monday. It's Monday right now, if y'all didn't realize. Miami Monday. We don't even live in Miami. But the Miami... It's close. It, it's literally right... It's like 40 minutes away. It's like that, that far away, bro. Oh, Anyways, my God. Yeah, fucking... I don't know what to call this shit. Hey, y'all gonna find out what this shit's called, bro. Yeah. All right, we out, bro. This is good ass podcast. Y'all come next week, tune in, and you know, tune subscribe in. To we might be down. high, we might be drunk, we might whatever. It's not like we're seniors or anything. Yeah, it's not like we're uh, I mean, under. We're like thirteen years old each. I don't got a beard. Uh, y'all can see my beard though. Me neither. Anyways, yeah, thank y'all for watching the podcast, listening, do all that shit, bro. I don't know what y'all was doing. Maybe y'all was taking a shit, listening to the podcast. Y'all was they having didn't even sex. Gotta, they didn't even gotta watch anything. They just gotta yeah, they could just hear this shit, bro. It's just us no, sitting down. Yeah, I appreciate it a lot, though. I appreciate it a lot, though. Make sure you guys give a like, subscribe, all that, do all that mm. fancy shit, bro. I'll see y'all in the next one. Put it out the coop in the lot. Put it for a 12 fuck swap. Pussing all the bells out the box. Hit the lick with the pop. Had to put the stick in the box.